Yeah, Mike, this is Deke. Richard brought in Shane Riley, but when I went to the shack to question him, he wasn't there. Uh, yeah, uh, about that, Mike. I tried to bring him in. I really did, but he, uh, well, put up a hell of a fight. So he didn't leave me much choice, Mike. He didn't. How we do things around here. Yeah, yeah, Mike, I remember. Lost Lake out. Thanks, Ricky. Brian, I'm at one of your beacons. Which one? What do you mean, which one? This Nero radio has a GPS, doesn't it? Yes, of course it does. I, uh, okay. Uh, you're at Olali Falls. Okay, good. Uh, keep an eye out. A field op is gonna be there any minute. Oh, Brian out. Oh, Brian! Oh, God damn it. Oh, Brian. Come in. Your friends are here. O'Brien. I told you, they're not my friends. Okay, head in on foot. Yeah, 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 I know. Uh, what do you want me to do? Uh, use one of these tracking down. devices. Let me know when it's no, clear. don't, not this time. I'm already tracking this one. Follow the researcher, and she's there to investigate an infected subject, the, the freak, that was tagged in a nearby cave. A cave? You, you want me to follow armed Nero goons into a cave? Just stay close to her. While you're in range, I can intercept her data. <gasps> well, Brian... I'm still working on the info you want, don't ask. Then why the hell am I talking to you? O'Brien out. Sound off, people. Locked down. Clear. Yep. How's the site look? Are we clear? Site check's complete. I'm 
long do you think we got? How the hell do I know? We'll bug out when the docks finished. Wasn't even my turn on the duty roster. Complain to the CEO. Do I look like a CEO? Yeah. Anyone else hear that? Jesus, this is taking forever. It's not so bad. Did you see something? Seems like a lot of freaks around the grotto. Yeah, I don't think I've ever seen so many. Right, O'Brien? Yeah. I never got that. Easier said than done. Got what? The whole stage uh, one, stage two. Hey, I don't want any trouble. Did you see something? Okay, Stop. okay. We're entering a quarantined I'm area. Leaving. Come in. I've 
I've got the data. Receiving it now. Thank you, Drifter. What the hell is she talking about, O'Brien? About this virus, whatever the hell it is. What, what it's doing. I want to know what the hell's going on. Why are they out here? What the fuck are you doing? O'Brien! Okay. I'll be in touch. O'Brien out. Nothing. I, uh, got tired of listening to the radio free work and they take so much of his truth or bullshit, you know? I wonder about Dick, uh, Ad Addie told me how I'd be dead if it weren't for you. Getting the N.I. whatever the fuck's, you know. We were riding uh, Boozer, I, uh, must have been fun. Hold me down while she fucking wiped up. away at me. Took a knife to themselves. <laughs> Remember how uh, Jack carved up that turkey last time we was all together? I had to get up sleep all the way the table. Well, it's done, Boozer. It's done. It's over. Uh, Deke, uh, sorry, I'm feeling, feeling a little woozy. Yeah, uh, hey, Addie's gonna kill me if she finds out you're out of bed fucking around. Yeah, I, I hear a bunk, uh, calling my name. Lost Lake signing off. Hey, listen, Boozer. <sighs> Boo... I've been uh, thinking about what you were saying about doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. So where are we heading? You ever been up to the caves north of the lake? I know. Come on, see if you can keep up. Okay. Let's go. I got marsh duty anyway this morning. Gotta see if any freaks are stuck in the muck out that way. When's the last time you went up there? In a few years, I guess. When I was a boy, we used to live in that damn cave. My old man sort of fancied himself a geologist. Sounds like we got a couple. Freaks stuck in the mud, I mean. Yeah, sounds like. Here, let me take care of them. All right. Here's that. Nice work. Schizo's just found a new man for the job. You know what Schizo can go do. Anyway, as I was saying, we spent hours talking about how all these caves were formed when lava flows would harden on the outside, but the molten cores would still flow like buried rivers. You got the big caves that drew in the tourists, like Metolius up there. And there's way more than that. 
riddled all over these parts. Okay, okay, we're coming up on the highway. We gotta be quiet. Goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him. Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. Now don't get too close. Stay down. Just what the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah, in July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer two, Ricky, Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these hordes. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandium Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley, north of the Cascades. And you think they're coming up from California? Highway's closed off. No one's been south of the Santium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that the hordes come in every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. You got that much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. need to see them to know that they're around. We figure out a way to stop the hordes coming through. Maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know goddamn well you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? This is how I'll be. God damn. Yeah. They stand there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. Alright. My knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Tell me. When does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do, where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw one, still flying. I followed them. I stole one of their radios. I've been trying to track them down, see if they have a base around here. 
Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive, you know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind on the freaks. They're studying them. They got resources to do that while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the grotto caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They had motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks used the cave during the day, and, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. They said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake and north up to Smith Rock, all used these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blew up those caves. Maybe we have a few less to deal with. Hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but a job like that, it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT. You said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer. This is how we do it. <sighs> All right. All right, look, there's some things I gotta do, okay? But you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. St. John. You were supposed to be up at the farm an hour ago. My guy said he's got a shovel waiting for you. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike. You'll get your ass up that way today, or you and your gimp boyfriend are gonna find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn battle. Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. St. John out. A few weeks back, we were riding west along the old Belknap Road. We ran into a bunch of crazy ass, almost naked, all scarred up. Hey, what's up, man? Hello. Ah, got it. All right, later, man. Hey. Hey, Blair, how's life? Uh, yep. Uh, you would come back soon, huh? Here for your bike? Hey, how's life? Shit, you really need a lot of fuel. Okay. Who the hell's my ratchet wrench? I can never find anything. I worked at the Humane Society, had a small office and a dog pen outside of Sisters. Had maybe a hundred dogs. Yeah, give me a sec. I'm doing a mission in Dave Bone. You appearing offline or something?
And to own TNT, you had to register with the county, keep copies of the keys to all your lockboxes with the commissioner. Wait, the county courthouse? Where the hell is that? I thought you knew. It's in the old federal yeah, building. Sure. The old federal building. The one in Sherman's Well, camp. the wet thought that made Jesus, all those fucking Mike, people disappear. What the hell? You told me... You, you told me that you were never setting foot in that place again. Did I? I don't recall. You were drunk right after... Joe was killed. Here. And I tell you, oh. Yes, I am Mike. I already know where I'm going. Mike. The place is gonna be crawling out. I don't think this is a good idea. Weather holes will be safe enough. Alright. That there? It's the old federal building. That's where we're headed. Let's not go looking for trouble. Stay out of the buildings. Come on. Yeah, I'm just gonna equip my pistol way. just in case. Where are we headed? Just follow me. Key will be on the commissioner. Fun. And and you know where he is? Where his body is? Yeah, I think I do. You heard what happened. Yeah. Everybody got wiped out, man, woman, and child. Only a few got out, and and uh, you you were one of them. Right. Only two got out. Me and Nora. But it wasn't the freaks that took us out. What do you mean? Here. That's me putting in the whole fucking little odd basis with the battery here as well. Says called the truce. A meeting. Right here. Oh, we knew what was coming. We knew what was coming and we were prepared. Fight didn't last long. But it was I'ma make this slow. You didn't give a damn about sealing the caves. You brought me here be because you, you brought me here because you wanted me to see this. Not true. All right, you got the key. We're gonna go get the maps to those mines, just like I said, and we're gonna get more than enough TNT to seal every cave in the valley. Bullshit. You are right about one thing. I'm not sorry you've seen it. Not following you, Mike. I am talking about the war that's coming. With the Rippers, the one that Schizo so hot for. Do you think he cares how many die on either side? Never mind. Come on, let's get this done. Here's the door. Come on. Gotta find a way upstairs. My con bomb pig. Smells like something died in here. I'm taking it down. Yeah, I smell of it. Bad business. Never mind. Don't try my new unbeat. There's a couple of five pounds pieces in there to start off, okay? Okay. All right. This is it. Now we got maps to every mine in the county showing where they stored their dynamite. Okay, come on. You hear that? Yeah. Were well, you expecting anyone? No. Do you have my back here? Hey, I don't like starting trouble, but I'll finish it if I have to. Care of myself. I'm not saying you can't, but remember the last time that we were out in the shit. Yeah, like I said, I'm staying behind. Oh, 
That's all of them. Let's go. Right behind. Stay down. Freaks. Bringing the whole goddamn town down. why no one goes into Sherman's camp. Eddie finds out you're out here risking your ass like this, she's gonna be pissed. Now how would she find out about something like that? Not from me. Why you wanted me to see that shit? You know what I mean? I only saw a bit of myself in it back in the day. How's that? You don't give a shit. Oh, you care about your friend. You don't want to see him die, but me? Any other goddamn person on the planet? I don't think so. Caring will just get you killed. Yeah, that's right. Thing is, not caring will get you killed just as easy. Folks of Sherman Camp did was stop caring about anyone but themselves and their own. Easy to kill a man when he's just some piece of meat standing between you and what you need. Schizo wants to kill Rippers because he don't think they're human anymore. You don't count. Standing in the way of what he wants. Well, I don't buy into that shit. I won't have it. Here's the door open so the room can 